Here we go. This is it. Huh? All right. You roll it. No, you can't stop the rain from falling. You can't hide away from fear. People pressure pain. Everybody said, where do we go from here? We are very excited to share with all of you a brand new thing here at the studio. And you can see it behind me. It's that beautiful tape deck over my shoulder here. It is a 1979 MCI JH16 two inch analog tape recorder. It's from an incredible era of recording real records with a big sound. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did we do it? Did we do it? This is the drama. This, this is, is why they don't do this. It goes back to my very first recordings, hearing the band play back uh, after we've cut to a two-inch tape. It's been fully restored by Chris at Mara Machines. MCI only made this model for two years. To find one that's actually a 16 track is even more rare. Every track has a lot of width and that makes the sound. There's a thousand words that I could say to make you come home. There's properties to analog tape that make it rich sounding and it adds a little bit of compression and a little bit of analog harmonic distortion and it's just the, the right kind of stuff. It's very musical. Baby, I don't want to. So I'll just hang around and find some things to do to take my mind off missing you. In this Pro Tools age, we have so much flexibility and so much power that sometimes we defer our decisions musically until later in the process. That wasn't so on the great records that you and I remember from the past. Uh, there was a group of talented people in a room working together and collaborating working out all the details of their arrangement, excited about it, sharing their knowledge of the music. And then when the time came, there was that immediate moment where you put the deck into record and everyone gives their best take. That is one of the best advantages of working with tape. And as a producer, all the stuff inside me just tingles. <laughs> it just feels good thinking about it. <laughs> Drummers, bass players, guitarists, engineers have just loved recording to tape and there's a lot of plugins trying to simulate it, but once you hear the real thing, you can't go back. So we're delighted to have that available now. Yeah.